Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at the official MIUI 12 update for the Redmi Note 10 Pro, obviously with Android 10. So, without wasting more time, let's start. So guys, last month, the Note 10 Pro received its official Android 10 update with MIUI 11. And I was like, just not going to uh, review it with 11. So let's wait for MIUI 12 update. And here we go within a month and plus 10 days, like 40 days. Here we have the MIUI 12 update with Android 10 officially here. And as you can see, it says MIUI 12 uh, global, uh, global stable, 12.0.1 stable. And as you can see, uh, Android security batch is August Android 10, obviously. And it is specs. Here we go, you will uh, see all of your device specs, the kernel version and other stuff. So guys, MIUI 12 brought a lot of UI changes with it, but you also got the control center. Now this is the default. If you want to change it to the control center, you can go into settings and into uh, a display. Uh, down here into control center and notification shade and use the new control center. Just enable it and here we go. Now we are getting the iOS style uh, control center here and as you can see it looks good but you know it resembles iOS and I just hate it you know when Android guys just you know copy stuff from iOS like just keep it separate but yeah MIUI like the Chinese things everyone uh, the real MIUI on uh, they copy some stuff from iOS actually some icons or some stuff on the UI I don't know why but yeah it's it's like obvious the Chinese OEMs do this. Then this is the settings UI which is much more cleaner, some icons have been colored and updated and some menu also been uh, you know categorized well and it looks really nice actually. Uh, there is no uh, issues in here without uh, like it's lag free, totally lag free, you can easily scroll down any settings and all the feature stuff, everything is working totally fine. Then obviously all Android 10 uh, stuff is present here, the dark mode, uh, which is a system wide dark mode. And also we have this adjust wallpaper to dark mode. So it will like adjust some elements of the wallpaper, I guess. I don't know actually what it does, but yeah, system wide dark mode is there. So yeah, all of your supported dark mode apps will be uh, in the dark mode. You don't have to, you know, manually switch to them. Now here under notifications, you can control the lock screen notifications, loading notifications and the new UI is here as you can see notification shade and here are all the apps uh, for which you can you know disable and enable notifications so yeah it's a really uh, easy ui easy to understand thing then we also do get the lock screen clock format and you can change it uh, to these four styles as you can see this is samsung style this uh, i don't know what style is the basic miui one and this is also good no no it adjust it gets adjusted and yeah you know the font it's not a, it is not like resembling to the android 10 version of the lock screen but yeah, it looks really nice here and now into here about phone storage as you can see this uh, is also nice the animation the ui and going back uh, down here uh, this is the digital well-being and the ui of the digital well-being is you know show your data uh, the same uh, google ui is present you don't get any uh, you know modified stuff uh, it's not uh, modified like the one UI. Then here battery and performance, as you can see, it will turn red once, uh, you know, it uh, just decreases down below to 20, uh, below 20. And here we have the battery saver, ultra battery saver and uh, battery usage info and schedule power and off. And here into battery usage info, you will get the battery usage, all that stuff, your uh, apps which are using more battery, you can just like disable this thing. <laughs> if you want, if you don't use Play Store, you just disable it and uh, what else uh, okay let's move to the fingerprint uh, and face unlock fingerprint unlock is working fine it's a bit slow uh like a second delay face unlock is also working fine but first time while i was adding in front of camera it just you know it just stuck uh like just take a it was just freezing but yeah it is working fine as you can see i have set it to unlock directly not stay on the lock screen and you can also, uh, you know, if you want to read notifications, you can like, okay, it's unlocked, notifications read. If you're, it's like important, then just unlock it. So yeah, face unlock and other security features like fingerprint pattern, everything works fine. So guys, that is it for the MIUI 12 update review with Android 10, obviously. So, you know, last month we got MIUI 11, the Android 10 update. I'd prefer to stay on that because that was good one. Uh, this is also good, but you know, it has just those UI changes and all that stuff. Better stay on the MIU 11, which you have already done. And here, yeah, obviously, official ROM users, if you want this stuff, you can easily update via OTA. And if you are a custom ROM user, you have installed it. But yeah, if the custom, uh, the recovery, if it supports uh, the OTA thing, then yeah, you're good to go via the OTA. 
but i'd say ma11 was better than 12 because this shitty ui changes were not at all needed what needed was to remove the apps remove the bloatware shitty bloatware and those fucking ads like it is really bad like sorry for that but those ads are really annoying like why when i was setting the uh, phone the ma12 and then i got like two ads and it was because of that get apps thing so yeah like if you know any uh, easy procedure to disable that just let me know about that then i can pin that but yeah here we go let's start with the installation uh, i will give you the fastboot installation in the description or you can you know watch any other video for the fastboot uh, installation via fastboot now this is the recovery installation via the custom recovery so let's start and obviously if you are on the miui 11 or any other older versions on the notes and pro if you are on official rom you are going to definitely get it in some days you know uh, xiaomi has started rolling out so it will be gone uh, to everyone in like a few days so yeah wait for it or install it by custom recovery or by fast boot whatever you want you can do the installation process so yeah now let's start the installation via custom recovery i'm using the pitch black recovery just remember just use the latest recovery and yeah i know most of the users are custom rom users so yeah uh you have to wipe your basic stuff and while you, you are doing the fast boot thing it is you know a good option to update if you are not using custom roms like the recovery you just wait for this update and if you really want you can just you know, go and download and update it easily then just install this the miui 12 zip and boom good to go then reboot and yeah most probably you know my custom recovery has stayed so yeah your custom recovery will also stay if you're using the rom from xiaomi for your updater from my link so yeah just use the link down below just don't download it from any other site so yep that is it uh, let the installation finish and then we can end the video and the installation is successful and takes a bit of time to install and you can just watch the bar the installation bar so don't get confused or something like that so yeah it's reboot system and that is it uh yeah you can root it if you are uh no a device uh, if you have a device with unlock bootloader and custom recovery you can root it via magisk uh, i haven't tried but yeah you can obviously root it it's like nothing like it's like not allowed or something like that but yeah that is it if you guys like this video and the installation part like it was the recovery installation part it was easy kind of easy just wanted to show you this but yeah if you like this video press the like button oh my god it again fell down this is this is really bad I don't know how it fell, but yeah, it is like in the last video also it fell. Okay, just sorry for that. So if you guys really like this video, press the like button. If not, dislike button is there. Also subscribe for more videos. And if you watch till the end, then I like for you also. So yeah, bye bye. And also guys, please take care. Just you know, the cases are you know those numbers are going up. I don't know uh, what is this, uh, but yeah still please guys take care this is a really important time now it's getting more critical so yeah you have to take care of yourself also please wear a mask okay you just don't have to touch that or just you know get it down just wear a mask the normal way not the cool way okay so bye bye